I just have one more question. What do you think of the um, idea of the New World Order? Do you think that's what we're headed for? Yeah, well, we, we are. And, and, and um, you know, the United Nations, there's, there's two scenarios for America if this carries on, on right now. Either America surrenders its sovereignty to the United Nations and the world, New World Order, and that's the New World Order or, um, you know, one world government. And that's the United Nations openly about this. This is anything controversial. Or America basically faces either war or blackmail from the combined forces of its enemies. I'm talking Russia, China, Iran, Nicaragua, Venezuela, North Korea. So, you know, America goes peacefully into the arms of the United Nations. Um, war may be avoided, but tyranny will not be. Or America may face the combined military might of its enemies and will have a choice at that time of surrendering or facing um, or facing nu- massive nuclear, biological, biological and uh, military attack. So if America restores its subsidy and the conservatives manage to, to um, change the government and change the quality of the government, you know, the future for the United States is very, very, is very, very bleak. Mm-hmm. And the horrible thing is there's nowhere to run because mm-hmm. if America goes down, every other Western country will follow. So you'll basically have world tyranny. And so um, every freedom-loving person in the world has a very strong vested interest in America turning around and 